Hello dear friends, this is Hello Hollywood, that means you're in for some exciting news, let's get started. Throughout most of her career, Taylor Swift remained discreet about her political leanings. However, during the midterm election six years ago, the singer-songwriter chose to publicly share her thoughts on the matter, a decision that deeply unsettled her father, Scott Swift. With the 2024 presidential election just seven months away, Taylor has yet to declare her support for either candidate. However, this year she is expected to once again align herself with the Democratic Party and the incumbent president, Joe Biden. During the 2018 midterm elections, Swift made her political stance clear for the first time, expressing opposition to the Republican Party and indirectly to then-President Donald Trump. Speaking to Variety magazine at the time, the Bad Blood singer revealed that her decision had terrified her father to the point where he considered purchasing armored vehicles for her protection. The singer's father was candid in his own opinion. I've read the entire and right now I'm terrified. I'm the guy that went out and bought armored cars, he confessed to Taylor before she published the statement. Despite Scott's concerns, Taylor proceeded with her decision. This was a situation where, from a humanitarian perspective, and based on what my moral compass was telling me, I knew it was right and I really didn't care about the repercussions, she explained. However, she empathized with her father's worries. My dad is terrified of threats against my safety and my life, and he has to deal with how many stalkers we encounter on a daily basis. He knows that this is his kid. It's where he comes from. Six years ago, Swift decided to speak out in favor of the candidates most closely aligned with her values. I always have and always will cast my vote based on which candidate will protect and fight for the human rights I believe we all deserve in this country, she stated in the document. First of all, she put the defense of LGBTQ rights. I believe in the fight for LGBTQ rights and that any form of discrimination based on sexual orientation or gender is wrong. She also supported the rights of people of Kola, saying, I believe that the systemic racism we still see in this country towards people of color is terrifying, sickening, and prevalent. Finally, she openly said she would vote for Phil Bredesen for the Senate and Jim Cooper as Tennessee's representative. She also called on people to inform themselves about the candidates' platforms and vote based on who most closely represents your values. Experts consider Swift to be one of President Biden's most valuable assets. However, it remains to be seen if she will speak so clearly and forcefully again, or if her support will be more discreet on this occasion. That's all dear friends. Share this video, and leave your comments. Bye bye.